As we ramp up into the big beating heart of hurricane season, we'll continue our storm deployment prep with some tough talk about how much you can make as an independent adjuster on a hurricane deployment and how to recalibrate your expectations so that you're not disappointed. Starting now. This is Adjuster TV. Hey, it's Matt here with Adjuster TV. And for the best tips and tools for getting on the first call list as an independent adjuster, subscribe now. Click on the bell notification because we all need more bells in our diet. And thanks to Mount W from YouTube who says, that breakfast part was great. Thanks for watching to the end of the video. If you're wondering what the heck we're talking about, check out the what's in my truck video. As with most things in life, we can avoid disappointment if we temper our expectations. It can even help us to make better decisions if we don't put all of our eggs in one basket or act out of fear. What am I talking about? Hurricanes and the money you've no doubt heard can be made. But before we jump into this video, I wanna quickly tell you about an incredible service called Schedule It. With Schedule It, you can route your claims, build your schedule based on parameters you set, contact your insurance, and this is a huge one for me, update your activity diary automatically. That's on all major IA estimating platforms. Setting up and calling your new claims, especially on a big hurricane event, takes at least a full day. A day you could be out in the field closing claims and getting checks into insured's hands. Improve your cycle time, improve your customer service metrics, and earn more money faster on CAT with Schedule It. Many new adjusters get into this business because they heard about the money. In fact, I'd even go so far as to say that everybody who's ever been interested in becoming an independent adjuster became interested when their eyes went wide the moment they were told how much a guy made over the summer on Cat Hail or on a hurricane like Irma or Katrina or even Andrew. So why do people get into this crazy career? A lot of people are looking for ways to get caught up on their retirement after a lifetime of now instead of later spending habits. Many people are just sick of the grind and imagine that this IA career will be their ticket to a new life where they can work hard for a few months and then chill the rest of the year and play with their kids and mow their yard at 10 a.m. on a Tuesday while all their neighbors are at the office. And then there's the people who just want to get out there and build a career where they can, by their own efforts and strategic thinking, make what they want to make in a day, a week, or even a year. A lot of folks believe that there's a hurricane every year and that's all we do. In fact, that's what I thought when I got started. I didn't pay a whole lot of attention to the national weather news until I got into claims and then suddenly I was a meteorology expert and nailed to the TV whenever there was a tropical wave moving off the coast of West Africa. But the truth is, hurricanes just aren't that common, in spite of a few recent years in a row of activity. And the claims we get on hurricanes aren't all the total losses we see on TV or could even be categorized as severe damage. An adjuster will handle some of those to be sure, but they'll likely handle many more regular old wind claims. As hurricanes move inland, they lose their devastating power. They still do a lot of damage, but it's generally not as catastrophic as it is where the storm makes landfall. So you'll get some big claims and you get a lot of little claims, tree on fence, water spot on ceiling kind of claims. And all things being equal, in this way, a hurricane deployment is just like any other wind hail deployment. Okay, just jumping in here real quick. If you like what you're seeing so far, be sure to hit the like button. And if you know somebody who you think might find value in this video, be sure to share it with them on social media. Okay, back to the video. If you want to make really good money on a hurricane, you'll have to close a lot of high quality, accurate claims in a short period of time. The fact of the matter is, is that you can't just show up on a hurricane deployment and expect to make 60 grand in six weeks especially if you've never handled a claim before. It takes a deeply focused effort on time management and training to get to a place where you can make money like that. And yeah, yeah, before you comment and tell me how much your friend who was green as grass made on Irma in four weeks, I totally understand that there are absolutely going to be exceptions. But your chances of being one of those exceptions are pretty small. Don't count on getting the once in a lifetime assignments in the best areas. Hurricanes cover huge regions and you can't pick the claims that you get. Even if you beg, they're still going to give you what they've got no matter where it is or how bad it is. So if you get the call to go work a hurricane this year, should you just say no because it seems like Matt is saying that hurricanes aren't worth the effort? 
Not at all, but temper your expectations. As a newbie, one of your best opportunities to start a career as an independent adjuster is a big hurricane deployment. You bring your A game and you hit the ground running by closing solid claims and your IA firm will notice you and they will give you special attention so that you don't wash out. And success on this first event will set up the rest of your career as an adjuster. You may not make crazy money on it, but then again, you just might. If you go into it with the expectation that this is your opportunity to get your career started off right and not just as a way to make a buck, then you'll find yourself making better decisions about how to get ready for your first hurricane deployment. Question of the day, what are you doing to prepare for the peak of hurricane season? Let us know in the comments below where you're watching this video. And keep an eye on adjustertv.com for updates about my upcoming cat deployment survival training. If you got value from this video, you can help me create more videos just like this by subscribing to Adjuster TV on YouTube. Wondering what to watch next? There are tons more videos right here on the Adjuster TV YouTube channel. And as always, thank you so much for watching and have a great storm.